Rapper Blueface, a story the Aiden's Now investigators first broke. His real name is Jonathan Porter, and he's accused of violating probation, which he received after a shooting outside a Las Vegas strip club in late 2022. In October, a judge warned him if he violates probation, she would send him to prison. His lawyer says he plans to turn himself in, but he's already in an L.A. jail, also accused of violating probation in a California case. You can read more at 8newsnow.com. Well, just like that. Blueface, I'm sorry to say, I don't have a good feeling about this. So, as you just seen, Blueface got another warrant issue. This time it's issued from where he's on probation at. Well, one of the places he was on probation at. Um, the most recent, which is Las Vegas. If you don't know, he's locked up right now for a violation of probation in L.A. for him going to Vegas. But and he just got this. He just got this time, this probation time, like not even a year ago, maybe four to five months ago, maybe four months. Um, I'm not surprised, bro. I'm really not, because Blueface, your ass is out of control, my nigga. But you know what? Blueface is still fairly young. You know, men develop slower, you know what I'm saying? Like, especially slower than women. Um, I ain't really start getting that good knowledge Pause. Well, not pause, but pause. So I was like, you know, his age, 25, 26. That's when I really started, you know, thinking like, damn, what the fuck am I doing? Like, I've been doing this thing all... Not all wrong, but if I was doing this, if I was doing this life thing a little bit more controlled, a little bit more, imagine how much more I can get accomplished, how much bullshit I can stay out of the trouble, stay out of the way of in trouble. But he got a, and I said it too. I, don't, I think I reacted to that video. I think it was on live where I did a personal reaction. It was is in the warnings for when he made his girl beat some white girl up in Utah for taking pictures and shit. Like you too reckless, my nigga. Like you, you gotta think, bro. Like. First of all, you got too much to lose, too much money. You looking out for too many people, taking care of too many people. For two, you a nigga, you black, like nigga, and you, quote unquote, a self-proclaimed self gangbanger. The chips is already against you, my dog. Like, but I once this is what I know. I I know that before I had to go to prison, I know that all them scared bids I did. If you know what a scared bid is, it's like when you go to jail for like two, three months, four months, one month, one and a half months, five months. I, I did a bunch of skid bids and shit. You know what I'm saying? And jail wasn't enough, bro. Jail's not always enough for everybody. Just jail, not prison. Jail. You get in the jail, you know you're going home. You're sitting there for a couple months, couple weeks, couple days, couple hours, whatever. It's only a little bit of time. You know what I'm saying? You ain't sitting in jail over unless you got some kind of special hold on your shit. You, anything over two years, your ass going to prison. He got five years over his head. They probably going to smack him with that five piece. Now, shout out to Wack 100 because he been getting that nigga out of a lot of trouble, but... You gotta think this nigga's on probation for shooting a motherfucker. Let alone, and you then you violating in this state. You already in violate. Like he's doing too much, my nigga. And I'm tweaking off motherfucker Krishan and um um old girl Bonnie. They getting tattoos of the nigga. Like <laughs> they, I don't, I, I, I don't know. But I'm, I know that a five year bid is a long time. I wouldn't even tell my girl to ride with me for five years. Maybe two. Women got her knees too, though. They Women got their own, you know what I'm saying? They're going to want to get some dick. You feel me? Um, But sometimes niggas need prison. Like, they got to sit down and be like, damn. I got years in this bitch. More than two. More than three. More than four. You see what I'm saying? I got years. Um, It's a shame, but... Sometimes you gotta learn the hard way. And Blueface would be straight. He got money if he does. Now, if they smack that nigga on the, or the wrist again and let him reinstate his probation, which they might do that. Shout out to Wack. You know what I'm saying? So Wack got they got some of the best lawyer teams over that motherfucker, looking like thugger in them. Like they got Brian Steele over that motherfucker, but um Johnny Cochran or something like that. But um yeah, man. Um, it's, it's not. It's looking. It's looking dark. It's looking dark for the nigga. The, blue, the boy Blueface, man. It's looking dark, bro. Um, I don't wish it on him, but I just got a bad feeling about this one. It's, it's been too much. Too, 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 too much shit going on, man. Um, he been he been violating too much. Not just probation, but just violating in life. You know, and the internet presence doesn't help. You think them same probation officers don't know you on the... Uh, you know what I mean? They know who you is. 
You got to put that shit on the paper. You got to, that's, that's part of, I'm pretty sure them telling him the probation, like he's a famous rapper, he's a da 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 da, -da that help him get these type of probations. You know what I'm saying? Because he's productive, he's doing shit, but you're also doing bullshit and crimes and shit and fighting and shooting and all type of shit. Like, and then that girl in Utah, what if that was a Mormon girl? You know, Utah is mostly Mormon. That's what motherfucking young boy at. Like, you ain't about to just get no Mormon girl jumped at the fucking show and, boy, please. But y'all let me know what y'all think, man. Like, comment, subscribe, notification. I'm gone. Yeah.